Welcome to the Schaefer Library of Health Sciences Forensics, Murder, and Medicine Exhibit. I'm Mr. Bones and I'll be your tour guide for this presentation. The idea for the exhibit began innocently enough. Well, for the world of forensics, one of the librarians received an email from the National Library of Medicine. The email discussed a pamphlet detailing the 1853 murder trial of John Hendrickson, Jr. Why did this catch your eye? The trial was in Albany and featured the testimony of Dr. James Salisbury, one of the earliest graduates of Albany Medical College and the inventor of the Salisbury Stake. A plot began to form. Librarians Anne-Marie Lahamadou and Debbie Wellspeak arranged to meet with college's archivist Jessica Watson. With the help of Mrs. Watson, the two Sherlock Holmes began investigating AMC's forensic roots. In addition to Dr. Salisbury's contributions, the clues led them to an 1848 thesis by Dr. Elihu Butts on the importance of medical forensics. The stage was set for an exhibit on the past, but what about the here and now? A PubMed search revealed that AMC faculty were still actively engaged in forensic activity. From the scientific to the sensational. As part of the exhibit, the articles were copied and put in red binders for a little light mood reading. Library books dealing with forensics, murder, and mayhem were gathered in one place. A nice dark bookcase seemed appropriate. My friend was so excited to be a part of the exhibit that I'm afraid he lost his head. But I digress. To reach the broadest number of customers, a website that consisted of the best of AMC's forensics past and present was designed. The site highlights the historical content of the exhibit as well as the available forensic resources from the library's databases, including pre-formulated searches, such as Dynamed, Lexitox, Visual DX, Natural Medicines, and Psychiatry Online. Links to websites beyond AMC resources were also included for further research. Warning, not for the faint of heart. Since everybody loves a good mystery, we worked with AMC's public relations department to spread the news throughout the institution and right outside the library. An open house planned around the exhibit was scheduled for October 29, 2010. The event was an unqualified success. Everyone pitched in. I even volunteered to help out at reference. This just goes to show that everyone loves a good mystery. You never know what mysteries you'll uncover in the library.